Good morning, Ghana. Wow, um, it's been incredible since we've been here. The welcome, the slave castle, the Ashanti King. Ah, oh, it's been awesome. And uh, looking forward to today. You know what, we haven't even been to the pool over there, man. That's the thing, you know I mean? We've been so busy since we've come here, but um, today is more about, you know, we've got a lot of media duties. So um, I did an interview on TV last night over here. Uh, I've got a couple other interviews, TV, radio, like loads of those today. And then also hoping to meet some Ghanaian Arsenal fans, maybe one of the groups or something, get together with them. So today is all about sort of building up now to the big game on Sunday. Of course, we've got a big watch party here with Ghana and Arsenal fans, and I'm really looking forward to meeting loads of them. It's been incredible, but you know, the, the, the amount of Arsenal fans in Ghana is incredible. Um, so really, really looking forward to today. But where's Cecil? This guy's proper lazy, you know. They said what, be up by half seven, right? It's now five to eight. Is he still in bed or something? Yeah. He's still in bed? Yeah. Bro, this younger generation of nowadays, man, I swear to God, man, lazy. Well, actually, no, I'm doing the younger generation a disservice, not the younger generation, just Cecil. And then he'll get up now, he'll have about three showers. Anyway, looking forward to today, can't wait. The Ghana uh, tour continues, and um, yeah, and plus as well, I'm starting to get a bit of, you know, goosebumps because the game's coming up and it's a really important game, West Ham, you know, I, mean, I know we beat Liverpool last week and that was great, but we really need to beat West Ham this weekend, um, just continue that momentum, so come on you Gunners. Welcome to Cecil, ladies and gentlemen, this is a big, big round of applause for Cecil, That's he's it. actually made it out of his bed, you know, thank you very much for gracing us with your king. For your presence, you know what I mean? Yes, 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 thank you. You know, people start to learn after a couple of days. First couple of days, got all this hot stuff on, long shorts, tight top on, wearing a jacket, look at him now, shorts. <laughs> He's starting to feel the heat now, so I had to get sensible. But it's all good, man. There's no aircon, so I've been, I've been hot for a long time, so today is shorts. This one got big up the chef, Chef Amwa, or Richard for short, I prefer Amwa, right? Yeah. Big up, man. Listen, you've been looking after us since we've been here. Good. The food's been great. You're coming in the morning, right? Yep. And we're all tired and we're all miserable now. You always got a big smile on your face. <laughs> yes, that's what we love, man. Even before the food comes. Right, so respect, man. No, thank, thank you. you very much. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Yeah, off to, yeah, uh, Chief of his media duties. I'm actually looking forward to this. It's going to be nice to see, you know, all the other outlets, radio outlets here. What it is, what I'm most looking forward to is meeting Arsenal fans. That's what we're waiting for, really. To we've seen a few, obviously, but a big meet up later. I want to talk about the West Ham game. Start previewing what is potentially going to happen on Sunday. So yeah, man, it's going to be. Listen, it's going to be. A, it's, every day has been amazing, beyond my expectation, if I'm honest. So I'm expecting today to be exactly the same. First stop of the day. We're here, TV station, TV free, gonna be doing a TV interview, big TV station in Ghana. So yeah, I think we're running a little bit late, so let's get in. Closing his eyes, relaxing. It's like a professional this. <laughs> <laughs> it's pointing us like he wasn't enjoying it. He was loving that. <laughs> the people are in the building. Exactly. That's how we say it in Ghana. Yeah. We came into the airport and we was uh, greeted by dancers and there was Arsenal fans there and it was just an incredible reception. We wasn't expecting that, you know. Exactly. When I'm in England, obviously big um, Ghanaian community um, in England. And of course, don't forget, you mentioned Mohamed Kudus, but we have a Ghanaian player as well. Partey. Thomas Partey, yeah. Being here in Ghana, I mean, so far, has been incredible for me. I'm, I've had such a great experience. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you too. Thank you. Cecil, so, so come up here and do a photo. It's proper TV studio. It's nice to see a TV studio here um, in Ghana. That's what the makeup match with on the screen here. Yeah, yeah. I heard him <laughs> about makeup and all that. Yeah. He was just jealous. Just jealous because he wanted some lipstick, you know. 
here in Ghana because we've got uh, a watch party that's taking place at Arsenal versus West Ham and also we've come here to meet Ghanaian Arsenal fans so that's why we're here in Ghana. Proper media there, this is a proper media junkie, real things, behind the scenes all of it. PFM. Happy PFM. Yeah, then we have um, Asasi Radio later. Yeah. And uh, then. Uh, so we, are we going to them now? Yeah, we're going. Right. So you have your, one of your Arsenal supporters here. How you doing? Good. How about you? Good. Very good, man. Good. Great to be in Ghana, man. Great to be in Ghana. So that was him filming you? Yeah. Yeah. You got it. First stop done in the media, uh, on our media junket. It's probably just been on TV. The diva, he just asked me to take photos of him. He's like, hold this, hold my glasses. I like the makeup. He said so many things. I'm like, he loves all this. He loves all this, but it's fine. I'll be his skivvy, his little run around today. That's fine. It's fine. Well, that, hey, listen, hold the way, man. What? He probably did <laughs> bad mouth for me or something like that. He bad mouth for me or something. What did he say? Nothing. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Said, I know. He's just I little, said, I said, I'm his little sneaky moves no. he's doing, but don't worry, man. I said, I'm proud of you, man. Like, it's proud nice of, to yeah, see I'm you sure you was, man. yeah. Oh, I am, man. <laughs> Hey! Whoa, Terminate Trees! <laughs> Link up today, bro! Okay! <laughs> yes, Terminate Trees! Let's start, you good? Have you watched the video? The, not the new one, you, you, you're in it and it... You need to see it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I did everything I said, but I did it all my way, oh wow. Told you when you came my way, can nobody take your place? Next stop, this is MX24, I think it's a radio station we're at this time. Yeah. Talking to the radio host. Oh, they're asking me to hurry up. You ready to do the makeup, Seth? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. You're, you're trying to start a narrative around this makeup. There's no, no, there's no, listen, he enjoys it, man. He enjoys it. Just watch his face when he's doing it. It's like this. <laughs> Can we bring in the makeup, please? You want the makeup? <laughs> For Robbie? Second TV. Stop. He's asking for all the people to come and help him. He said, Makeup, I need my, my, my mic on. You, you had your makeup you done. Your makeup done. Your, this narrative, you're not trying to spin that makeup. It's just Cecil, man. Because uh, I'm better looking than He's jealous. <laughs> Something he wants. You want some makeup, don't you? Welcome. Get that boy some power. <laughs> <laughs> Back. This is the AM Club right here on MX24 and uh, it's about time we get straight into AFTV. The whole crew is right here in Ghana. It's been my first time in Ghana, you know what I mean? And um, been really enjoying it so far, you know, the, the people have been great. Wow. So yeah, no, so it's been awesome. Wow. Awesome being here so far and I'm wow. um, really looking forward to meeting all the Arsenal fans at the uh, the watch party, you know, so yeah. you know, it's fantastic. Gentlemen, thank you so much, no, Robbie, thank you. Thank, thank, thank you too. Yeah. And uh, we'll look forward to Sunday as well. What up, Rob? What up? Let me get his water. Sure. <laughs> on to the next one, man. Back in England at the moment, it's really cold. So I give thanks for this heat, man. You know what I mean? Because yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Really enjoying it. And it's, it's been it's been um, wonderful being here. You know, meeting um, different fans as well. You know, it's been fantastic. We're really excited for Sunday. Um, it's a free event. We just want you guys to come your numbers. There's a lot of um, things we're planning. You know, giveaways, um, the watch party as well. And there's going to be obviously Ghanaian celebrities there. You know, so it's not just about football. It's also like a community development thing that we want to do. Let everyone engage and communicate and, you know, network with one another. That's really the focus. Speaking to fans after the game. So we'll be doing fan cams with fans mm -hmm. here in Ghana, which will go up on the channel. You, you will be part of the whole AFTV content for that weekend, you know. I know how passionate the fans are because, you know, I meet so many of them in London. So it's, it's going to be great. Thanks to the crew for coming. Guys, enjoy Ghana. Hopefully we'll meet, we'll meet again on Sunday. Definitely. for the game and the watch party. All right, thank you guys. Thank you. Hopefully, we have a blast on Sunday. Thank you, thank you, thank you my friend. Take care. Thank you. Yeah. Listen, what you didn't see as well, right? The first TV um, appearance, Robbie had his makeup artist and that. After they finished, she come back to obviously wipe the powder off and he asked, can you do my toes? He asked for a pedicure. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't catch on camera, but I was like, oh, Rob, I can't believe you're doing that. Obviously, you'll be seeing me in the back of all of these, probably doing his radio and TV. I think he did really well on the radio, yeah. He's got a good face for radio, man. Really good face for, a good face for radio. Yeah, man. Good face for radio. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, me too. I, I could have knocked this fucking guy out, yeah. 
Right, carry on. Carry on. <laughs> So again, a sassy radio this time. What's this, number five? Diva, look at you, you can't keep, see what I mean? You can't keep, that's what I've got to be here for him, man. Cosmo TV host, uh, who just entered my studio with uh, Ishira Abdul, who's on the ABS show. And here basically to meet as many Ghanaian Arsenal fans and football fans I as we know. possibly can. And you my are... chairman is one. I'm one because of my yes. ex-boyfriend. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was an Arsenal fan. Oh, of yeah. course. I'm going to so how comes, it, how comes he's your ex? You know what I mean? He yeah, actually... That's a long story. But well, how, well, you you know what, how actually, are you actually enjoying we, we, Ghana? Yeah, we won't get into that, but at least he did a good thing by making you support Arsenal. Yes. <laughs> good seeing you. I, I also I love you. I mean, you guys been making people cry. He sold out O2, he sold, bro, I don't even want to. They just did 55,000 stadium the other day. Because we're coming to support you now, I can be talking about the West Coast. Oh, yeah, all right. I can, I'll easily support oh. Arsenal as well because of yes. my, my, my guy. So you're an Arsenal fan? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. We'll buy Kudus. But that's year. the truth, though. Yes. I support oh, Kudus. Yeah. If you buy him, then we'll I can. Easy for you. Might have to get back into reggae. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. yeah. <laughs> Big respect. You know, the culture is really steep in yeah. Africa. It's all, you know, blackness. I really duly represent music of black origin. So, I mean, nah, take away the reggae, dance all. R&B, hip hop, everything and yeah, anything. No. If it's not Arsenal, then it is personal. Yeah. Better support the best team. If it's not Arsenal, then me take it personal. Because we don't know Thomas Party and the rest of them. Kudus is gonna join you. Blum, 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 blum. <laughs> we're taking it personal. If it's not Arsenal, you know the thing going on. Stone boy, play us up with the legend of legends. Stone boy for life. You don't know anything, set man. Gone out of the world. Yeah. See. It? Last media bit of the day. Look, it's pitch black. It's been a long day being Robbie's assistant. Uh, never again, I'll tell you that. He's hard work. We have the people from AFTV. There's a big viewing party. And I'm Cecil G, presenter at AFTV. Cecil G, I like that. <laughs> I like that. In love with this club since I was a little kid and uh, wanted to start a platform that gave ordinary football fans a chance to have their opinions on Arsenal, no matter who you are, no matter where you're from. They always love our first sight. We met my <laughs> <laughs> No one's ever said that to me before. You know? <laughs> Worst signing ever for you in your books. Worst? <laughs> There's a few. <laughs> Worst signing. Oh, man. Um, <laughs> Kim Kallstrom got to come to mind, no, right? No, no, no. Deliver your message to Rob. Maybe Mikel might just hear about it. Guys, thank you for being on the show. Thank, thank you. you very much, man.